There's so many great things about Frenchie Davis, we don't really know where to begin, but let's do the warm-up first, okay? <laughs> this is why Frenchie is a good singer and I'm not. Go ahead. I was just doing... <laughs> it helps wake the voice. <laughs> but I can't do it. How do you do that? <laughs> well, there you are. Uh, she was on the top eight of The Voice, part of a great summer concert series at The Grove. Your opportunity to see her tomorrow. But Frenchie Davis singing for us live this morning. There are so many things to talk about. Uh, first and foremost, Miranda Lampert uh, is a good cocktail maker. OMG. Um, <laughs> <laughs> at the rap party for The Voice, she was like, Frenchie, have you had a drink? Let me get you a drink. And it, I don't know what she brought me, but it's like the strongest cocktail in history. The, the moonshine. <laughs> Uh, they're, let's talk about the I voice. Love her, I, I mean, her Blake is so sweet. The, the thing that you you had an experience with twice, first with Idol and then with the voice. Yeah. I don't think people necessarily appreciate this extraordinary power of television. Yeah, I mean, when I see what reality TV has done for people with no talent, it's like <laughs> you, you've got to <laughs> you got to give it a chance. Well said. <laughs> Imagine what to do with people that. So when you essentially reappeared on the Voice. Yeah. And Christina and you hook up. How quickly does everything just reignite again? Um, I mean, it was, I mean, to put it in perspective, I, when I first auditioned for The Voice, I had like 4,000 Twitter followers and now I have like 32,000. Wow. So it's, you know, it definitely um, allowed me to share my gift with a larger audience and, uh, you know, it allowed me to actually compete this time. And, and, to, and, to, and to speak of an actual gift, this is another real interesting thing. Damon, the fine musician who's here with French, and you're going to hear his great guitar playing in a second, but you have a different relationship with Damon as well. Yes, Damon is actually my trainer. I've lost four dress sizes working out with him, and he's the business. There it is. <laughs> well, we're going to get to some business. Uh, French is with us through the course of the morning, so we've got a lot more to talk about, including the Michaela boyfriend, Frenchie scandal. Ah! We'll get to all that. Frenchie, live at the the Grove with Blake Lewis, who is so talented from Idol as well. Tomorrow at 7.30, it is free. It's open to the public. 3Ws.thegrovela.com. And now live on the KTLA Morning News, here is Frenchie Davis. It's complicated. It always is. That's just the way it goes. Feels like I've waited so long for this I wonder if it shows Head underwater, now I can't breathe It never felt so good Cause I can feel it coming over me I wouldn't stop it if I could When love takes over Yeah, yeah, you know you can't This has been so fantastic all morning with Frenchie Davis, the top eight, of course, on The Voice. And now you can see her tomorrow live at The Grove as part of their summer concert series. And not only Frenchie Davis, the very talented singer on that tour with people from The Voice, but also the actress. 
Yes, I am playing a small role in a movie. It's a comedy, and I just learned that Tom Arnold and Carl Reiner will be in it, so I'm really excited. I'm playing an office receptionist who's also the face of a religious cult where all of the members are bald. So, well, well there it is. <laughs> I'm really excited. It well, sounds hysterical. Yeah, <laughs> that does sound like fun. All right, speaking of complex relationships, <laughs> explain the obsession that, that a, a squeeze of yours has with Michaela <laughs> and, and how that would just... No, no, no. Let's just let's just get it all out of here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, <laughs> a gentleman friend of mine. He is a big fan of Michaela's, and he has a huge crush on her. So. And you were told you couldn't come back without a photo. Is that <laughs> exactly. Right? I have to take a picture with her. Done. And done. done and done. Fair yes. enough. <laughs> um, Doc in the Bay. We're about to hear. This is such a great, great song. Do you hear him sometimes? And like, that's the one I got to sing. Yeah, I do. Like, sometimes I hear songs and I'm like, oh, man, I love this song. I, I got to figure out a way to sing this. And, you know, that's, you know, I just love to sing. And um, when I hear good music, it inspires me to sing. And this is a classic song, and I love it so much. And um, I've always loved it. And then I heard Sarah Bareilles sing it, and it made me fall in love with it all over again. And so I'm really excited to sing it. For well, you accompanied by her uh, trainer and uh, musical, <laughs> uh, Damon, who's so good. But now live here on the KTLA Morning News with Doc of the Bay, here's Frenchie Davis. <laughs> Sitting in the morning sun I'll be sitting when the evening comes Watching the ships roll in And I watch them roll away again I'm gonna sit on the dock of the bay Watching the tide roll away Mm -hmm. I'm sitting on the dock of the bay Wasting time Watching the tide 